On the mound, Jared Schuster, 24 years old, 6'3", 210 out of New Bedford, Massachusetts, first picked by the Braves in the 2020 draft out of Wake Forest. Profar climbs in, Schuster is ready. Foul tipped into the mitt. Good start for Schuster. And there's one out here in the top of the first. Ezekiel Tovar, good night last night. 0 1 lined into center field. Harris will have to play it on a bounce. He continues his solid series. Now three hits in the series, and he's aboard of the one down. Elias Diaz homered last night. Runner goes for second. Darno throws down. Got it. Goodbye, Tovar. Two away. Well, Braves catchers have just been phenomenal all year long. That's a good pitch to throw on. Travis, great, received it well. Great transfer, perfect throw. And again, Albies, oh, so close to being in violation. And <laughs> Elias goes to where he probably would stand most of the time. Albies, Albies couldn't get to it, and it's a base hit for the Rockies' DH. The Rockies have two hits in the inning, but still looking for that first run Randall Gritchick hitting out to left center pretty well struck long run but guess what Michael Harris is fast he closes on it reels it in and that'll do it for the Rockies in the top of the first to Nelson Lamette he's the right hander 30 year old right hander out of Santiago Dominican Republic on the offensive side got to be patient to Nelson Lamette does not throw a lot of strikes heavy usage of his slider he's going to try to get guys to chase that so be patient don't make him come into the zone and pay off pitch to the Braves leadoff hitter and that one is also nowhere near and Acuna trots down to first base to my point the guys got to be patient he is not filling up the zone don't do him any favors Acuna breaks for second and he slides in his 30th stolen base of the season to go along with his 15 homers. And now Ozzie Albies awaits a 1 0. Grounds to the right side. That'll move Ronald up 90 feet. A productive out, one away. Of the last 12 walks the Braves have received, they've turned those into a run eight times and looking to make it nine of the last 13 with Acuna down at third base and one down. Mad in the hands of Austin Riley, looking to give the Braves the lead. Here's his 3 2 again. And he missed again. It gets by Alfaro, and Ronald scores. And the Braves. Just like that, are out in front. And the Braves do indeed turn that walk into a run. It's one nothing Atlanta. Two walks and a wild pitch and a stolen base. Not a good combination to begin things for the Rockies, obviously, tonight. This offense has been electric. The cleanup hitter, catcher Travis Darno. This ball is hammered to left center. Look out at Chattanooga. My goodness. Darno puts the Braves up three to nothing. That's the 18th first inning home run that Colorado has allowed, which is still a major league high. It is the 100th homer of his career, and it was not a cheapie going over 470 feet. The Braves are looking to continue their winning ways. Nolan Jones leading off the second inning for the Rockies. What a catch at first. Metals in full extension. He better check his webbing. That was a missile. What a good play. Two out walk. First walk allowed by Schuster. That'll bring Coco Montez up to the plate. Good location there. And Montez is down looking, and that'll end the top of the second. Riley for the second time draws a walk. Oh, here comes Travis Darno. He sent a shockwave through the ballpark with a two-run homer back in the first inning. He might have done it again. Yes, he did. Oh, yes, he did. <laughs> Travis Darno. What did you have for your pregame meal? Five to nothing. And they can't stop this man tonight. Two down. Nolan Jones, who ripped a line drive at 112 miles an hour in the second inning. He hit it last time to Olsen, and Olsen robbed him, but this time it's off of his glove. Olsen throws to second, though, and they got him. Ha! Jones couldn't believe it. What a throw. Outstanding throw for Matt. He was down the right field line and foul ground over by the sidewall. I didn't even know he had an arm. Yeah, a leadoff walk. One and two for Eddie. Braves leading five nothing here in the bottom of the fourth inning. It's one thing to get damage from the top in the middle, but when you get damage from the bottom two. In the air to right. Gritchett goes back and Gritchett will watch it. Another two run homer. 
two by Darno, now one by Eddie Rosario, and the Braves are on top, seven to zip. Well, if I'm hitting in the Braves lineup right now, I want to come up after the guy who just walked. No joke. <laughs> I mean, it's it's just been uncanny. First and third with no one out. Now Ronald trying to get in on the action. Ground ball to short. Tovar flips and on to first and a double play. The Braves do, however, get another run in. And it's now eight to nothing. Well, this has to feel pretty good for Jared Schuster to look up and see eight to nothing. So a double, a single, a wild pitch, and a walk. Loads him up with one out for Randall Gritchick. Uh, he needs a ground ball maybe to get out of this quickly. This is to short. Here's one on to first, not in time. So the Rockies will get a run. Bases are reloaded for the Rockies. That might do it. It will. And Brian Snitker is going to come out and make a change. But all in all, a nice night for Jared Schuster. He leaves with an eight to one lead. Base is loaded. The new pitcher is Kirby Yates on for the 25th time this season. 2-0 with a 338 ERA. Braves have an 8-1 lead, but the Rockies do have him loaded for Alfaro. The good news is two down, so Joey just needs one out somewhere and get through this jam. Well, he's got Alfaro right where he wants him. Yates deals. He struck him out. That away, Kirby. He leaves them loaded. Runners at first and second now with two away. So a couple of strikeouts for Ben Heller. Welcome to Atlanta, Ben Heller. Three K's at the top of the eighth. And it's still the right-hander Heller on the mound for the Braves. Oh, well, two from Heller. Got him looking. Beautiful sweeper. All four outs have been strikeouts. He struck out three in the eighth, and now he strikes out Montero to start the ninth. Ben Heller with another 0-2, and he struck out another one. Make it five for the right hander. So two down here in the ninth inning. He's not going to strike him out, but it should end the ball game. And it does. Braves win. Eight to one. Ben Heller all smiles. Welcome back to the bigs, young fella. He strikes out five, pitches the eighth in the ninth, and the Braves cruise to an eight to one victory.